What's up, everybody? You're watching Indie Loop, and in today's episode, we're talking to Hector of Luna Face Promotions, a passionate, prolific Houston based promoter that has dedicated himself to providing local and national acts a platform to show their souls. So let's go ahead and check it out and have a chat with them. I'm here with the founder, creator of Luna Face Promotions, Hector, actually a good friend of mine and one of the hardest working promoters in Houston, without a doubt. So I want to thank you, man. I know you're busy. So I want to thank you for, for you know, giving us the time to talk to you a little bit. Um, you know, I've been to a few Luna Face Promotions events, man, and I'm always having a great time. But for somebody who hasn't been to one of your events, can you let them know what they can expect when they come out to a Luna Face show? Yeah, most definitely. One thing that we try to create when we do uh, Luna Face Promotion type shows is to bring a different energy to each event. Um, well, each event is curated differently, and what we try to do is to bring dynamics to each one. If I go into the show not feeling that dynamic, there's really no point in me actually doing it. It really, you know, it has to be the energy from when I confirm it with the booking agent to when I send that deposit and when I roll with the show until the end. The energy has to be there. If not, if there's some like a little break up there, it just it's just not a good feeling at all. And one thing I try to keep doing is not not just bringing music I like, but bringing music for the people. You know, people request me different artists to bring, and I try to do that for the city of Houston because I think that. It's about time for us to break that barrier and really step out of our natural comfort zone and work with other artists that you will never see here. So the energy is very important. That's one thing that I, when I go to one of your events, man, you feel the energy and uh, you feel it from the rock bands. I mean, you, you kind of work with rock bands, DJs, hip hop acts. It's a very diverse mix, which I really respect. Uh, I've seen your transition from being a music artist to a promoter. Um, I'm curious to know, how do you see the current local music scene and where do you see it going in the future? It's gotten so, so much bigger. I mean, that's a great question. Um, it's, um, Houston is, a, we're going through a renaissance and it's a beautiful thing. You're starting to see talent from each angle, 9180s. I mean, all these different people are just incorporating different sounds and styles and techniques. And it's just a beautiful thing to see. You know, I think it was, you know, Houston's such a big melting pot. It's such a big, multicultural city and you're really starting to see it now so it's a great great beautiful thing and I got so much respect for all these artists that are really doing what they're doing you know and um, it's just gonna get bigger and better it's it's a beautiful thing yeah. and much respect for you man because you're actually responsible for making this happen and giving creating this platform from a lot of music artists to come out here and do their thing so we definitely respect that um, you got a lot going on man I know I know I'm gonna be talking man. you're talking about I got this show I got this show um, you know you got a lot going on for Luna face promotions what can we expect for the remaining 2012 for Luna Face? What you got going on, man? I'm just going to keep it kind of going with what we have. You know, I got Daniel Johnson in town today, and then it continues on with uh, the uh, Cashmere Union Stage Band and DJ Newmark and Damn Funk and Peanut Butter Wolf, Casey Veggies, Action Bronson, uh, Rock Ham. This will all be until the end of the year, and then next year it's just going to get bigger and better. I'm definitely feeling the progression each year, so that's what's keeping me going. If it, if I didn't feel that, I think I would be done. You know what I mean? So it has to. It's it, it's it's like your kid. It's from a baby to it keeps growing every year. And if you don't feel that, and if you feel like there's a stall out moment, and and you know, if I feel that, that's just not a good thing. And what I try to keep doing is preserving that Absolutely. and continuing with it and feeling that excitement as this child is growing. Cool. We'll definitely see a progression. And guys, if you guys want to experience the Luna Face event, you definitely got to check it out. LunaFace.com. Stay updated. They're also on Facebook, Twitter, uh, and stay connected. He has a lot of stuff going on, guys. So be sure to come out and support your local music scene. And uh, I think that's it, man. I want to thank you very much, man, for your time. Absolutely. And guys, thanks again for tuning in for another episode of Indie Loop, your social loop for all things independent. Stay tuned. We'll see you guys next time. Peace and love. Yeah.